Hi, welcome to Easy Curtains. Uh, so you're looking to order a bay window curtain track. It's very simple. Don't worry about where your bends are, what shape your window is. So all you need to do is measure your window where you think the track's going to be. So, for instance, if we're going to start here, measure along here, along here, along the middle of the bay, across the other side, and then out of the bay, assuming that you're going out of the bay. If you're going to measure just within the bay, just measure the sides within the bay, add those sizes together, that's where you're going to enter the total track width into the box on the uh, form. Don't worry whether it's within a centimetre or two, it's not really critical. Just be as accurate as you can and enter that figure into the box. Enter your track width in the box here. 385 centimetres just for example and it's as simple as that. Right the next step is choosing how your track's going to fit. Is it going to fit to the wall over the top of the window frames or is it going to fit to the ceiling within the bay and then maybe wall fix as it comes out on each side of the bay here and here or it might be ceiling fix all the way round. Ceiling in the bay might be the same height as the ceiling in the room, so it'd be ceiling fixed all the way across. So go on the form, select one of the items from the list which describes best how your track is going to fit. In this example, we're going to select option two, which is ceiling with wall fixed returns out of the bay. So within the bay, they're all gonna fix upwards into the ceiling of the bay and then to the wall on each side out of the bay. Right, the next selection you're going to make on the form is the bay shape. We've got a splay bay here because the sides splay outwards, but you might have a square bay, you might have a curved bay. So from the list, select the closest one to your bay shape. It may be perfect, but just when you upload your form, you could be able to include a photograph of your bay. Pick the one that you believe is as close as you can and choose that one from the list. The next step now is choosing um, the bending service where we decide which bay shape we've got. And we've got various different um, ones here in the list. Uh, if you're not quite sure, the, the one that we're dealing with today is the display bay we return. So we click that, it comes up with an image. If that doesn't look like yours, then click one of the other options and see if you can find one that looks as close as possible to your bay shape. So the rest of the form the items are optional. You can decide whether you want your track in one continuous piece from end to end, or you can decide whether you want one track to overlap the other track. So effectively you've got two tracks, left over right, right over left. Great for blackout curtains, especially in a bedroom, because you block the light more. So if you're in a bedroom and you want them to overlap, choose that option. Um, then we have um, curtain draw rods. You can choose to have curtain draw rods. You clip them on and you can pull the curtains around. We will do a video about that later. Also, you get bracket options. How long you want your brackets. For instance, if you're fixing to the wall, you can have them three centimeters, four centimeters, six centimeters off the wall. So they're another option. Not sure, just choose the, the standard three centimeter and we can work that out later. Okay, so now you've got all your selections on the form. It will calculate the price at the bottom of the form. Have a look. If you're happy with that, then press to order your form and it'll ask you for all your details and your card details. Enter those and you've placed an order. You'll automatically receive an email to, and it'll direct you to a page on the website that deals with your bay shape and it'll give you a guide to help you do your measure up. Any problems, get in touch and we'll help you along with it. So thank you very much for watching this.